Oh. All righty, we'll be freezing for a reason next week at NBC Connecticut. It's the Special Olympics Penguin Plunge on Sunday, February 10th. And today we're joined by Heather Campbell, who participated in one of the Special Olympics Penguin Plunges last year, and Misha Campbell, who is a Special Olympics hand and local coordinator. Ladies, good morning to you. Good morning. Thanks for being here this Thank morning. Thank you for having us. You're welcome. It's kind of hard to think about jumping into cold water, especially <laughs> considering everything that we've had. Um, but uh, tell us, uh, really about what the, the penguin plunge is, Heather, and what can people expect? Well, penguin plunge is more like really cold, and um, penguins are cold. I like penguins. They're great, right? Yeah, they are great. <laughs> it's amazing. Everyone is like a penguin for the penguin plunge. They run yes. in the water and they jump into yes. cold water, right? Right. Yes. Um, so tell us, Misha, this is all for a cause. This helps raise money for Special Olympics. Right? Not only, it raises money um, for Special Olympics Connecticut, and they put on our magnificent programs four times a year. They're doing healthy athletes now, but it also gives back money to the locals, mm -hmm. and it helps our programs fund for our equipment, for our athletes to go to these programs to attend. And without this type of fundraiser and people in the community getting together, we wouldn't be able to do what we do. And these athletes would not be helped. So Heather's commitment and her family's commitment and her friend's commitment to raise money for this particular program makes a big difference for everybody in the state. There's over 6,000 athletes. I have been so impressed with this organization since I moved here. It is so huge in the state. And it is. Not only that, you guys help uh, raise money for other Special Olympics oh, yes. groups throughout the country. Yes. So this is such a great, um, we have such a privilege in our state to have such a huge program. Um, so tell me, Heather, about kind of like some of the events that you've participated in and just what it means to you. What it means to me is I do a lot of sports. Mm -hmm. And um, so I've so. done it, I was a kid, but she went in. Yeah. I was a year old and I felt great to be Good athlete I am. I'm gonna be a team player. I'm gonna be a team person that I am. Yeah. And, um, the me. the nice part for Heather and all the athletes, she's been with us 25 years wow. since she was eight years old. Oh, that's awesome. Is not only do they do the sports, but they make friendships that last a lifetime. They're working on their healthy athlete program in learning how to eat better, make it work for them. Um, the state of Connecticut uh, Special Olympics group has done a tremendous job in the 25 years I've been doing it. And this money makes a big difference to our programs. People are listening to this this morning or they're seeing the video and they think this is the year I wanna do it. I'm gonna make the plunge. How can they get involved? Please go to Special Olympics Connecticut uh, Penguin Plunge. You can pledge on pa pages. There are individuals that are jumping. You can make a direct donation to Special Olympics Connecticut. You can join a team. Even if you're a chicken, you can also make a <laughs> pledge. If you can't make it in the water for whatever reason, your money makes a big difference. I love it. Heather, are you going to be jumping in this year? I'll be jumping in the water this year. It's gotta be cold water. Do you go all the way in or just like your to your knees? Just just wear my knees, yeah, not my how, hair. Right. I'm not getting mm, forget more about it. my hair. We do not need Trust to mess me. the hair off. <laughs> <laughs> me. Ladies, thank you so much. Oh, you're this quite happening. welcome. Thank you for uh, having thanks us. Thanks for being here this morning. That is uh, next Sunday, a week from tomorrow. It's all happening at Winding Trails in Farmington at 10 a.m. And if you come to the event, you'll have a chance to meet the NBC Connecticut news team as well. For more information, just head to our website, NBCConnecticut.com, and search for Penguin Plunge. Bob Maxson, what kind of weather are we talking about?